Now at 11, tomorrow will mark more than one week since an eight-month-old baby was last seen, and there is new information in the search for Amaya Robertson. RTV6's Graham Hunter talked to family friends about the desperate need for answers. That was the truth on that baby. Clyde McPeak lives with the uncle of eight-month-old Amaya Robertson. They've been trying to figure out what happened to baby Amaya since she went missing last week. We've been trying to go to the scene, find out what can. Wednesday night, investigators continued their search in a field near South Belmont Avenue on West McCarty Street next to Eagle Creek. McPeak was there. Everybody started leaving. Then the mom and dad pulled up laughing and asking if it were all right. McPeak says baby Amaya's parents were at the scene as well. Not the way I'd be feeling if my kid was missing by any means. There were no tears in the eyes looking for a baby. The search continued Thursday as investigators flew a drone around Eagle Creek. They need to bring the baby home or find it. Law enforcement sources close to the investigation are telling RTV6 that based on information following Wednesday's search, investigators are going back to the site and expanding their search in the area and downstream from the area searched the same day. Somebody knows something, but they're not telling the whole truth about it. Baby Amaya went missing last Thursday and was reported missing on Saturday. Come on, you, you don't wait two days. I don't care who you are. Now McPeak's focus is turning to justice. Catch that dirty person that done it and make them pay. Reporting from the West Side, Graham Hunter, RTV6. Police still want tips in this case. If you have any idea on what happened to Amaya Robertson, call Crime Stoppers at 317-262-TIPS.